We have all experienced moments in life where people called us stupid, dumb, or other harsh words. Sometimes people may say it so often that you end up believing them, even though deep down you know that you're far from stupid. They may have pointed out some of your personality traits and made you feel self-conscious or insecure, but there may be a lot more to why some specific traits of yours may be different from that of your peers. To help provide some clarity, here are some signs that you have ADHD. You're not stupid. Number one, your mind is always two steps ahead. Have you ever found yourself on your way to finish a task, but suddenly glance at an unfinished project around you and instantly shift your focus? Inattention and lack of focus are the most common symptoms of ADHD. This could be due to a change in your brain chemistry. According to research, people with ADHD have reduced levels of dopamine and norepinephrine, two neurotransmitters concerned with attention and focus in the brain. So the next time someone calls you stupid for forgetting about an assignment or not remembering the topic of conversation, remind yourself that you're not stupid. In fact, you have so many wonderful and brilliant ideas that your brain takes a little extra love and care to keep up with them. Number two, you don't always remember what you were supposed to do. Do you remember that time you just got introduced to someone and had a lovely conversation with them until suddenly, no matter how hard you tried, you couldn't remember their name? Or perhaps you were on your way to a grocery store, but saw an adorable puppy, played with it, and returned empty-handed? People with ADHD perceive and process information in a different way than neurotypical people. An individual with ADHD may notice that forgetfulness is more frequent and that tasks requiring short-term memory are more difficult. ADHD can also affect how well your long-term memory works. Number three, you tend to focus on minor details that most people miss. Do you find yourself spending countless hours looking up details of minor things that most people would fail to acknowledge? Do you find yourself feeling completely engrossed in the things that interest you? Most people may not know this, but hyperfocus is a common symptom of ADHD. Hyperfocus refers to a state of profound and intense concentration. ADHD is a neurological condition regulating one's attention span to desired tasks, not necessarily a lack of attention. As a result, although some things are difficult to concentrate on, others are absolutely absorbing. A person with ADHD can become so absorbed in something that they lose track of everything else going on around them. You may lose track of time and disregard those around you when you're focused like this. And number four, people think you're overly emotional. Do you find yourself feeling overwhelmed with emotions? Perhaps the hunk of a car terrifies you or a small present makes you burst into tears because you feel deep gratitude towards the gift giver. Do people point this out and question your reaction to things whilst laughing at you or calling you stupid, quirky, or weird, or another unacceptable term? In both pleasant and unpleasant situations, people with ADHD experience heightened emotions. It's not rare for people with ADHD to be physiologically hypersensitive to touch, sound, light, and even textures such as garment tags, gravel, etc. Research suggests that many persons with ADHD struggle with emotional regulation, as demonstrated by symptoms such as low frustration tolerance, impulsivity, temper outbursts, and major mood swings. Did you relate to any of these signs? It may be hard for you to cope with ADHD when you're initially diagnosed with it. However, as time goes by, you learn to overcome the difficulties. Several treatments are available to assist you in managing ADHD. If you resonate with several of the above mentioned scenarios, then you could schedule an appointment with your doctor and they can assist you in finding the right support. There are available treatment options to help children, adolescents, as well as adults with ADHD. Find the needed support they may need.